Hello friends, welcome to Suresh Agarwal's Mathematics Shortcuts. Finding the HCF or the highest common factor of large numbers like 182, 208 and 754 can be time consuming. So you need a smart method to find the HCF of such large numbers because the problems of HCF and LCM are very frequently asked in most of the competitive exams, whether it is SSC, CGL or the UPSC exam, the CAT, MAT, the NTSC or various Olympiads which are conducted at school level. So we have a smart method in this video. So watch the entire video. And if you want to learn all the short tricks, uh, you know, you want to have a compilation of those 350 short tricks in neatly typed 338 pages then you need to go for the ebook of short tricks very useful for all the school students to develop that uh, 10 times faster speed of calculation and you need to practice these short tricks right from the school level so that you are a class apart when you pass out of the school the reasoning course 15 different topics we have already covered and both these ebooks you know they come with the video support so that whenever you don't understand anything from the ebooks, you can just click and watch the video to have a better grasp over the subject. So WhatsApp 9896369963 to get a copy because that's the only way you can get a copy of those PDFs. Uh, mind you, it's a very nominal costing ebooks, so please don't expect it to be totally free of cost. The question in hand is. HCF of 182, 208 and 754. So what methods do you know of finding the HCF? You know the prime factorization method, the method which is taught at school level. You have to make factors of 182, 208 and 754. So how much time do you think you will take to make factors of these three large numbers? Perhaps two minutes and then we have to find the HCF also. So probably 150 seconds, like 202 uh, and a half minutes will be enough for you to solve this through prime factorization, right? So prime factorization does not work for very large numbers. What is the second method? You know the long division? The long division method or the division method? That's also taught at school level. That also works in case of three numbers or three large numbers. A uh, little bit more efficient method as compared to prime factorization when it comes to large numbers. So I think you will be taking like one and a half to two minutes to solve this question through the long division method. So what if you can do it in say about 20 seconds? That will be wonderful, right? So for that, you need to understand that the HCF is actually a factor of, a factor of the minimum difference between the given numbers the minimum difference. So if you take the difference between 208 and 182, you will have the minimum difference as 26. Obviously the difference between 754 and 208 is much higher and 754 and 182 that is even higher. So the minimum difference between these three numbers is 26 itself and 26 can be split into factors two times 13. Now, if you see 182, 208 and 754, they are all divisible by 13. So 13 ones are 13, 13 fours are 52, 13 ones are 13 and then 78 means 13 six are 78, 13 fives are 65 and 104 means 13 eights are 104. So yes, all three numbers are divisible by 13 and we get the quotients 14, 16 and 58. Now check whether these three numbers are divisible by the other factor 2 or not. They all are even numbers, right? So 2 divides all of them and therefore the HCF of the three numbers is 2 times 13 which is 26. Mind you, if any of the factors does not divide the three numbers, all three numbers, then you have to eliminate it from the list of the factors out of the minimum difference and rest of the factors which divide all three of them will be taken into consideration while finding the HCF. Isn't that amazing friends getting to HCF in such a manner? 
I don't think you must have learned this method anywhere except this channel. So if you like this video, do share it with all your friends who are, you know, who are uh, interested in such interesting mathematical concepts. Do subscribe the channel and click the bell shaped icon. And I would love to hear from you what is the explanation of this method. Why does this method work? So you can send me your explanations on this WhatsApp number. All the best.